morning. Hello, good evening. Hello, everybody. Hello. How are you, good Rosa? Evening. Good evening. Oh my God, good morning. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you early today. Okay. That's, that's a surprise. It's a miracle. Yeah, I would say it's a surprise. Yes. <laughs> I guess we have, maybe you have something planned. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, I am, I know. I've been, I've been. I began. No, I have anxious. Ah, okay. You were anxious. Yeah, and I'm anxious because we have a presentation. <laughs> <laughs> that's, what, that's what I thought. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Okay, so welcome. Hi, Darwin. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Uh, Relax. Day. You had a good day. All right. So you feel yeah. happy because you? you had a good day. I'm okay. Thank you for asking. I'm very uh -huh. happy as always. <laughs> Darwin is relaxed. Always. Yeah, he's always relaxed. No ha habido, no fishing these days, Darwin. No ha habido pesca, no fishing these days. No, eh, go to the fish in my vacation the next month. Ah, the next month. Ah, yeah, I remember you said on vacation you are going fishing. So next month you are going fishing. Yes, yeah, yes. I visit the river, the Lempa River. Lempa River. Yes. And, and what fish, what fish uh, do you catch at Lempa River? At Lempa River, what fish do you catch? It, aquí en el país creo que le dicen guapote. Okay, I know it. Yeah, guapote, I know it. Guapote and what else? ¿Qué más? Mojarras. <laughs> uh, mojarritas. Mojarritas, okay. What else? ¿Qué más? What else? Uh, yeah, chibolo. Chibolo, yeah. Pepesca, some people call it pepesca, right? What happened? What happened with the marlin? <laughs> <laughs> only that, only that, solo eso, only that. Only that. En tilapia, no tilapia. Eh, no, no tilapia. A marlin, Darwin. <laughs> no marlins. That's that's in the in the ocean. Ese es en el océano, right? That's in the ocean, in el mar, and in the sea. Sorry. It's uh, how do you say the Miami marlin? Oh yeah, it's true. In Miami, <laughs> la, la mascota de, de Miami. Yeah, <laughs> it's true. No, but but here in El Salvador, I guess they catch marlin, but they do it like many miles away from the from the shore. Bien lejos de la orilla, many miles away. De donde, de donde ya no se mira tierra prácticamente, en el mar. <laughs> yes. I guess in La Libertad, they have some, some fishing tours. They, they, they take you fishing and you can catch uh, different fish. They have some tours in La Libertad, I think. Uh, it's in Costa del Sol. Yeah, yeah, in La Costa del Sol, I guess. They have some, some tours. And also in La Chadura, I guess. They have, they have fishing tours. Mm -hmm. La Chadura in Aguachapan. Yeah, that's what I know. That's what I heard. Eso es lo que he escuchado. That's what I heard. Okay. Yeah, but maybe we can get together for a fishing tour one day. 
Okay, so let's begin. So everybody, uh, so good evening and welcome to this uh, to this session. It's 10-4 and it's time to pass the attendance. Uh, right now I have, let me see, 17 participants, 18, par well, 17 participants connected. Good evening. Okay. Good evening. Welcome. <clears throat> All right, so let me pass the attendance quickly then. Um, Ada? Present. Very good. I didn't see Ada yesterday. Adriana? Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Angela? Oh my God, Angela is not connected. That's weird. That's strange. Darwin? Present teacher. Flor. Flor. Gloria. Here. Joanna. Joanna. Lourdes. I'm present teacher. All right, welcome. Margarita. Margarita no se mira por estos lados últimamente. ¿Qué le pasa, Margarita? Margarita envió un mensaje en el grupo. Ok, ya lo vamos Va a revisar. En el busto, David. All right. Mayra. Present. Miguel. Present. Nelson. Present, teacher. Very good. Ofelia. Here, teacher. Osmin. Present, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, Rafael. Present. Rosa. Present. Uh, Sandra. Present teacher. Jansi. Good evening. Present. All right, good evening. Sulma. Present. Asalia. Present, good evening. Good evening. Susana. And Ingrid. Okay, this, I guess they're not connected yet. Hi, okay, teacher. so. Hello. Hello, Denise. Okay, Joanna. very good. Okay, Joanna, welcome. Bienvenida. Welcome to this, uh, to today's session. All right. Good. So we are Angela going to también. start. And Angela is here too. Okay, thank you. Okay, so we are going to start uh, the class then. And just before we start, okay, I remember uh, yesterday we started some vocabulary, right? Yesterday we started some vocabulary, okay? How do you say, um, let me see, descongelar comida in English? Throwing food. Throwing food. 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 How do you say um, lavado de manos in English? Washing. Sorry? Hand washing. Hand washing. Hand washing. Hand washing. Exactly. Hand, Hand washing. washing. Hand washing. Hand washing. How do you say, uh, let me see, sanitizar in English? Sanitizing. 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 The verb is with ing. But sanitizar is sanitize, all right, to sanitize. And here we have sanitizing, okay? Uh, what is, uh, how do you say almacenamiento de alimentos or almacenamiento de comida in English? Food storage. 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 Right, food storage. How do you say comprar o compras in English? Purchase is the pronunciation. And the last one, method, método de degustación. Tasting. tasting method. Ah, the tasting method. Tasting method. All right, that's pretty good. This is just to remember the vocabulary uh, we studied uh, yesterday, right? Okay. Uh, but as you know, today uh, we have some presentations, okay? And I said the first thing for today's class presentations. I said, right? Yeah. So um, I don't know if it's my idea, right? Uh, I will give you five minutes. You go with your groups, and then we present. So to 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 prepare or to 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 see if you have something else to add, okay? Para ver si tienen algo más que agregar. Five minutes, and then we start with the presentations, okay? And then you go with your group. Vamos con el equipo. You go with your group. Is it okay for you? So you talk okay. for a moment and you decide. Rosa is presenting. And Rosa, you are going to say this. You are going to say that. All right? 
So five minutes to prepare, and then we come to the main session and we do our presentations, okay? Is that okay for you? Or you don't need time? Or not yes, need time teacher. Class yet? Yes, you need yes, teacher. All yes. right. The same number of the group, okay? Uh, team number one is Miguel, Ophelia, and Joanna. Team number two is Adriana, Zulma, Sandra, and Nelson. Team number three is Rosa, Darwin, and Azalia. Team number four, Mayra, Lourdes, Osmin, and Rafael. Okay, team number four. Team number five, Angela, Michelle, and Jancy. And team number six, Susana, Flor, Ingrid, and Carla. All right, yeah? Yeah. So please uh, select the group you belong to. Solo eligen el grupo entonces para que entren, okay? Yeah, okay, thank you. Let's go then, five minutes. Five minutes, all right. In five minutes, we do our presentations. Select the group you belong to, please. Good evening. Good evening. Ahorita vamos a los equipos, Rafael. A los equipos. Elijan el equipo en el que estaban. Rafael, equipo cuatro. Osmin, ¿qué equipo es? Number four. Exactly. Number four. Four. Ingrid, ¿qué grupo? Segundo, el tuyo, 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 uh, Ophelia is, is a present this this uh, this procedure. Okay, Ophelia, go ahead. El bruce days I I tell ¿Cómo se pronuncia este? Aquí sería, o sea, usted lo tiene que decir first step, step first, el primer paso. Ajá, primer paso. Ajá. Ajá, primer paso. One to to pass on the bruce. Do Bruce do tits? Four. What's the Bruce? Okay. It's a it's a it's a complete procedure. O cuando sea el 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 número cuatro y pues te puede decir. This is the last, the last step. The last, the last step. The last, last is the last, the last step. Uh -huh. the brush. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. The second, the second procedure or is finish. about this. Hmm? Or finish. Yes. Yes. You say finish. Okay. <coughs> okay. Um, okay. The second procedure is uh, is talk about a step to change database on uh, on the standby. Uh, Joanna, go ahead, please. Okay. The first step for this procedure is each of managed recovery. Second step, step down, step down, immediate. 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 Uh, is correct immediately. You need, I guess, in this case, you need to say immediately. 
El Guayas, yeah. Shut down immediately. 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 Yeah, immediately. Yeah. Immediately. So El Guayas, mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Shut down okay. immediately. Immediately. Shut down immediately. 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 Exactly. Immediately. Immediately. Okay. And next, move the affect data file. That affected. 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 Affected data files. Data files. Data files. Okay. And next. Start up, up. Finally, switch on manage recovery. Managed. 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 Managed recovery. Managed. 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 It's a more, it's a open the database in, in, in a state is mode. Ah, the right. database he have to mode he is state for uh, after the open. All right. Yeah. Before, uh, yeah. So I, I get your point, but in a, in, in by saying a startup, what do you want to say? Startup is a verb, I imagine, right? This is this is a common. This is a common. Of the Oracle, uh, the Oracle database. Ah, oh, okay. Startup mode. Yes. Okay. 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 Very good. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Déjame repasar nuevamente. Yes. Okay. Manage recovery. Queremos hacer. Hay un profe. Teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Tell me. I, I have a question. Yeah. In the group, in the pronunciation, the uh, the word a eva is is called a b a a b. Let me let me a check. A. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check first. O no sé si lo podemos sustituir por tax. Yeah, you, you better say ABA. 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 Yeah. It's correct. Yeah. No correct IVA software, teacher. No, in English, sorry. In English, ah. you say uh, BAT is different in English. It's not IVA. It's like value ah. added tax. Value added tax. Uh -huh. BAT. If you want to say the, 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 the acronyms, I mean, yes, you call them acronyms. You say, uh -huh, B acron, acron. you can say BAT or value added tax. BAT. Value added tax. BAT in English. BAT. Y entre paréntesis le pueden poner value added tax. B. A B. Look at, mm. look at my. V A. 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 E. T. And in parentheses, you can put value, 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 and then uh, guión, hyphen, added, como agregado, added, with double D, con doble D. No, added, added. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Added, with D at the end. Added, uh -huh. tax, space, tax. Ah, hoy aquí entonces sería mayor. Pero un bat, ¿qué significa entonces? Es, es son las siglas para eso. Agregado. Ajá, son las siglas para eso que está en inglés. Value added tax. B A D. Valor agregado. Ajá, en inglés you say IVA, you say B A T, you don't say IVA. B A T, value added tax, que significa el impuesto de valor agregado o el IVA, en otras palabras. Ah, okay. Ya. Yeah, thank you, teacher. Okay, Continue, no Sandra. Uh -huh. Okay. Second, type, type the purchase to the value of the software. Mm -hmm. Third, uh -huh. Pure print to the boot purchase. Then check and confirm if that record are correct. Next, make the task declaration in the website of Ministerio de Hacienda. 
And finally, click on, on send the tax declaration. Yes? <laughs> yes. Toto. <laughs> so you ready? But in Nelson, yes. Okay. In Nelson, the finish. Analyst procedure. Here, the boss informs uh -huh. the product code to analyze. Uh -huh. the, the analyst receives the uh -huh. report. Here, the analyst checks the code of the product. Next, he analyzes the real cost versus the standard cost in the system okay. tab. Everything ready here? Yes, yes teacher. All right, yes. just, let, just let me visit another group and then we start the last group, okay? Okay. <laughs> Receive the product. <sighs> Are you ready here? Yes. Yeah. Almost. Almost. All right. So I will give you two more minutes because I gave you like 12 already. Five minutes, teacher. Five. Vaya, as this is where I receive? The receive, uh, rec no, eh, eh, um, le falta una E ahí yeah. donde está la C. Receive. 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 the Receive. 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 Pero Sale no del supermercado. Chicas, ese es PowerPoint. Otro. Sale del supermercado. Um, o como podríamos poner. Let's go. <laughs> to the... Eh... Vaya, ¿y el último? Eh, no sé cómo podríamos poner, como sale del supermercado y o sale, ahí está como. Retirarse del supermercado. O solo le podríamos de, poner de, salida. Salida. O sale mm. del supermercado. Go out, que no es. Vaya. Este. Sería. Supermarket exit. Sería salida del supermercado. Como dijo. Pero Martín. aquí la imagen muestra que está guardando los productos en el carro. Uh -huh. Entonces, Como carga no sé. los productos en su vehículo y sale. Solo guardarlo, ¿verdad? Open it, put the purchase in the car. Purchase las compras. Algo así. Put, o put the products in the car and sí. leave the supermarket. Put, Ajá, algo así. The products. Purchase in the car, car, yes. Mm. Leave the supermarket. In the corner de la imagen. I creo que. Everything ready here? All is okay? Yes. Everything ready? Yes. <laughs> casi, casi. All right, almost. Who is going to present? Who is going to present? Eh, honestamente, profesor, ayer yo solo estuve de oyente. Entonces, ahorita, en este momento se acaba de conectar Ingrid y Flor. Y Flor. 
que tenía la presentación. Uh -huh. Ángel y Susana nos contaron que estaban en el grupo. Ya. Yeah. Entonces, eh, ahí está ya la presentación. Susana, acabo de... Susana, vamos a ver quién es, quién es acá. Susana, Flor, Ingrid y Carla. Carla no está conectada tampoco hoy, ¿verdad? Tampoco. Mm. Y yo estuve con ellas, pero yo no tengo... O sea, sí, sí vi la presentación, pero no, no la pude copiar. Pues. Ok, I understand. All right. Ahorita aquí ya le mandé un... Oh, pero okay. Flor, está, Flor está por acá. ¿En qué equipo están? Sí, ella, está, ella está aquí. Ahorita estoy acá, teacher, conectándome. Ah, ok. Llegando a mi casa. Ok, thank Estaba you. Estaba conectada desde el cel, pero me voy a conectar ahorita a la, a la PC. Ah, ok. So, um, so, we are going out. Ahorita vamos a salir porque ya se acabó el tiempo. Time is over. Ok. Ok. All right. Ahorita les mando una si quieren háganle captura de pantalla. Gloria, sí, Gloria. Sí. Ahorita le hice una captura de pantalla, pero cuando Flor la pueda compartir en la, en la sesión con el maestro sería mejor. Ya, yeah, it's Porque better. Se va, me, se va a ver mejor, digo yo. Yes, definitely. You are the last group anyways. Son de los últimos grupos de todas formas. You are the last group anyways. Okay. You are group number six, the last group, el último grupo. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. We are about to start with the presentations. Okay. Uh, so the, the, the procedure uh, we are going to, to follow is uh, The, I mean, the same order, the same order of groups. So group number one to present is Miguel's group, all right? Group number two is Adriana's group and so on, all right? And then at the moment you start uh, your presentation, the person or the participant who has the computer, share a screen, okay? Share a screen. La persona que tiene la compu, comparte pantalla, yo les indico. I indicate when, all right? <clears throat> And I guess you decided, right? I guess you made a decision about the, the member of the group who is going to present, I imagine. Okay? All right, let's, let's wait for some people because they are still coming back to the, to the main session. Okay? Okay. Okay, I guess we can start. Uh, so we are going to start uh, then with group number one, okay? And in group number one, we have Miguel, all right? Miguel's group. Miguel, Ophelia, and Juana, okay? So you can start, Miguel. And the rest, let's pay attention, please, all right? The others, let's pay attention, please. Okay. Uh, let me share my screen, please. Okay, go ahead. Uh, okay. Good evening, everybody. Uh, we are uh, we are the group number one. We have uh, two presentation. We have two procedures. Sorry, uh, the first procedure talk about bridge the pit. Uh, Ophelia, go ahead, please. One pass two pass on the brush. Number two, brush use the the feet. Number Number three, risk with water. Number four, what the, the brush. Okay, thank you, Felia. Okay. Uh, the procedure number two, talk about a step to change database on the standby. Uh, Joanna, please go ahead. Okay, thanks, Miguel. Uh, first step is uh, switch off manage recovery. Second step, shut down immediately. Next step, move the affected data file. Then start up mom and finally switch off manage recovery. Okay, very thanks. This is, this is all for the procedure. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Don't, don't stop sharing, Miguel. Thank you very much. No, dejes de compartir. Don't stop sharing, please. Um, just a question. Uh, in this case, in number two and number four, I guess, when you say shut down and start up, You want to use a verb, right? Quieren usar un verbo ahí. Ahí deben usar un verbo, ¿verdad? 
No, it's it's a it's a the step is this a a common it's a common of the procedure. Yeah, I got you. All right. So number two, for example, how would you say number two in Spanish? Eh, mover los uh, los data files afectados. Number two. Ah, perdón. Eh, hacer un, un bajado inmediato. Ah, okay. Uh, I think in this case, I don't know if I'm right, but shut down is separately. Shut down. No sé si va separada esa palabra. O así, ah, así le... Así. Como, hay como por comandería va unido. Ajá, porque o sea, es una acción. Es el una... comando, exacto. Uh -huh. Sí, pero ese es exactamente el comando que se digita para bajar la base. Ah, ok. Uh, shut down uh -huh. immediate or immediately. Inmediate. Inmediate. Immediate. Yes. Oh, immediate. All right, very good. And start up the same. It's the same, correct. Okay, yeah, I, I, I ask you because, I mean, this is your area, right? I know this is your area. Yes, yes. Yeah. And I yes, don't yes. know much about these terms. Yo no sé mucho en realidad acerca de esos términos. Es el significado en general, all right? But not the, the exact use in your area, okay? So thank you okay. very much, Miguel. Thank you very much, okay. uh, Miguel, Ophelia, and Joanna for your, uh, for your work. Okay, can you stop sharing, please? Okay. Okay, very good presentation. So please, everybody, go to reactions and let's give them um, a wow, right? Let's give them a wow. Go to reactions and let's give them a wow. Okay, a wow emoji. Okay, thank you very much. Good work. All right, now let's go to group number two. So let's listen to Adriana, Zulma, Sandra, and Nelson. All right, so you can share a screen in this moment. Okay, good night, everybody. Oh, good evening, everybody. <laughs> good evening. <laughs> uh, we are group number two. Okay. We right. will talk about two procedures. Uh, first procedure is purchase procedure. Uh, step number one is make the product request in purchasing system. Second, the boss must authorize the request. Third, the purchasing department receive the request. Next, the purchasing department look and buy the product. And finally, the purchasing department notify and deliver the product. Okay. The second question, uh, uh, Sandra, 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 say. <laughs> okay, Sandra, say are you there? Procedure. I think the step, a good podcast procedure. First, organize documents by correlate, correlate in day order. Second, tie the purchase to the value, value of the tax software. Sure, print to boot purchase. Then check and confirm if these records are correct. Next, make the tax declaration in the website of Ministerio de Hacienda. And finally, click on send the tax declaration. Fine. Thank you very much, your attention. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you very much. Great work. Adriana, can you go back on the on the previous slide, please? Okay. Uh, okay, so first your presentation was really good. Thank you. And you have a lot of information, okay? So uh, maybe just some observations, okay, in, in spelling, okay? Um, well, in the, let me see, authorize, must authorize in number two, the boss must authorize. Authorize is with TH, back on TH, authorize. Uh, just this is not only for them; it's for everybody. Okay, authorize the request. Back on TH. Okay, also TH. Authorize. Um, ah, yeah. Auto. In yeah. In number three, third, the purchasing department is singular. El departamento de compras is singular. So you put S in the verb. Receives. La tercera persona se le pone S al verbo. Recuerda. Receives. Okay. The purchasing department receives the request. <coughs> Sorry. The, the, the same for step number four. Next, the purchasing department looks and buys, okay? The S, yes, la S siempre, porque es singular y singular, okay? And finally, department, ahí falta la T, 
en the, the same row, lo mismo, la S, notifies, con S, IES. ¿Recuerdan la regla? Le quitamos la Y y le ponemos IES al verbo, ¿ok? And you say notifies. And, and deliver, ahí el verbo es deliver. Ok, notifies and delivers sería, porque delivery es entrega. Y ustedes quieren decir entregar, y entrega el producto, y entregas el producto, ok? So you say deliver, ok? And go to the next slide, please. Vamos a la siguiente. What does it? Oh, yeah. Um, mm -hmm, let me see here. Oh, I, I just want everybody to pay attention to this word. B-A-T, value added tax. In Spanish, we were discussing with this group that in Spanish you say IVA. But in English, you say VAT or value added tax. Ok, impuesto de valor agregado. Agregado. Okay. Ajá. Bernardo, pero ¿por qué VAT? Ah, because in English is value added value. tax. So las siglas serían VAT, VAT. Ok. Ok, thank you very much okay, for teacher. your thank presentation. You. Thank you. Great job. Can you stop sharing, please? You're Can you stop you. sharing? Thank you. Okay, everybody, so go to reactions and let's give this group a like. Let's give them a like, all right? Let's give them a like, like on Facebook, okay? Thank you very much, Adriana, Sulma, Sandra, and Nelson. Thank you for your presentation. So let's go to presentation number three, Rosa, Darwin, and Azalia. Rose, present, please. Who is going to share the, the screen? Rose. Rose. ¿Quién nos va a compartir la pantalla? Me, but I have problems. Wait, wait. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay. It's coming. Sure. It's, it's coming. coming. It's coming. Yeah, there we go. Okay, let me, let me. Hello. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. We are a group. We are a group number three. In this moment, a presentation or procedure. This procedure is analyst procedure. Here, the boss informs the product cost to analyze. Second, the analyst receives the report. First, the analyst checks the cost of the production. Next, he analyzes the real cost versus the standard cost in the system stack. Then, the analyst prints the risk, the result, and finally, the analyst sends the result to the boss and the manager department. In this moment, Broad presentation, you will proceed. Okay. I'm going to present in the equipment reservation procedure. First, the warehouse received an email from the sales executive with the offer accepted by the client. Where are all the equipment offered? Second, the inventory analyst prints the document. Previously checked in the system, the stock. If everything is okay, the auxiliary proceeds to prepare the order. Finally, the auxiliary sends an email notifying that the products are ready to check it and dispatch. And now Asalia is going to describe the daily income procedure. Thanks. Daily income procedure. First, check email, WhatsApp, and replay. Second, prepare and classify road. Third, make the calls to get the road of the day. Later, at the end of the afternoon, receive remittance of what was collected. And finally, settle and prepare the report for the day and deliver it to the boss for his respective review. Thank, thank you for your time. 
Okay, thank you very much for your presentation. Okay, so great job. I like the information here and the procedures. Okay, just some observations quickly. Uh, just remember uh, that the same the same observations uh, I gave group number one. Okay, so when you are using a third person, cuando estamos usando pro, um, sujetos en, terce, en tercera persona, la S al verbo. For example, the boss informs. Informs. Informs, yes, right? Informs, okay. Yes. The analyst receives is okay. That's perfect. Okay. The analyst checks, that's okay. Then he analyzes the pronunciation. Darwin is analyzes, okay? He analyzes el verbo. Como verbo se dice analyzes, pero como sustantivo, analysis, you say analysis. Analysis, the same, all right? Good. So um, basically, that's it. Okay. Just go to the next slide, please, Rosa. Or Asali, I don't know who is <laughs> the same. The warehouse receives, okay, receives, receives yeah. because it's third person. Yeah. Siempre es tercera persona, okay. And prints, that's okay. The inventory analyst, the inventory analyst prints, it's okay. And basically, well, basically that's it, okay. So uh, thank you very much for your presentation, uh, Rosa, Darwin, and Asalia. Thank you very much. Good okay. job. Great presentation. Okay, everybody, can you please go to reactions and let's give them a heart. Let's give them a heart, okay? Let's give them a heart for their presentation. Thank you very much. Good. And let's listen to group number four. Okay, in group number four, we have Mayra Lourdes, Osmin, and Rafael. Okay, thank you. Okay. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Um, we are talking about a, of payment procedure and access to restricted areas. Now, my partner Osmin um, will read the procedure payment. Okay. Uh, good evening, everybody. Thank you, Lourdes. Thank you, Mayra and Rafa. Uh, for this job. A payment procedure. First, check the payroll. Second, verify the salary to pay for each employee. Third, send to the manager the authorization troops <clears throat> the event. Next, the manager approved the transaction. <laughs> then the payment is popular to all the employees. Finally, the system sent the email of payment to each employee. Thank you everybody for your attention. Um, and then um, procedure access to restricted areas. First, send the email to request the approved to access, adding name of employee, ID, the reason, date, and hour. Second, wait the confirmation of the manager of this area. Third, when you receive the confirmation, print the authorization. Next, carry the authorization to the security guard. Finally, he checks the permission and if everything is okay, security guard allows the entry. Yeah. And thank you everybody for your attention. Okay, thank you very much. Leave the presentation there. Dejen la presentación, leave the presentation there, please. Okay, thank you for your presentation. Um, well, let's see, Mayra, Lourdes, Osmin, and Rafa. It was good. Okay, thank you very much. Um, maybe some observations quickly, okay, for the access to restricted areas procedure. Uh, on the second, you need to say, wait for the confirmation, wait for. Wait for is a phrasal verb and we use it together. Wait for the confirmation of the manager of this area. Okay, so that's the, 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 the order. Okay, so we need to put uh, four, okay? And I saw something else here. 
Oh, in, okay. in the payment procedure, in the payment procedure number three, third, send the manager the authorization through the Ivanka. Okay, mm -hmm. send the authorization, um, give me a minute. Um, let me see, yeah, number, th number three in the payment procedure, send the, the authorization to the manager through the Ivanka, you can say it that way too, okay? So the rest is okay. very good. Okay, thank you very much for your presentation. It was really good. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, okay everybody, now please go to reaction and let's give them a wow. Okay, let's give them a wow, all right? Thank you very much for that presentation. And we listen to uh, team number five. We have Angela, Michelle, and Jancy, okay? So let's listen to this group. Please. Hello, good evening. Um, we have two procedures, and uh, one of these is a online purchase, and the second is purchase and process uh, in supermarket. So I'm start with the first procedure. Uh, for making an online purchase, you need you need uh, first, first go to the online web page two log in to your account three select the items you want to buy and check the price five write your shipping address six confirm the method of payment and credit card information. And finally, confirm uh, your information and submit. And that's it. Uh, for the second uh, procedure, I don't know who will present. Azalia, uh, pardon, uh, Jansi. <laughs> Okay, yeah. this procedures, procedure is purchasing process in the supermarket. First, entering uh, to supermarket. Second, parking. Uh, third, take, take the product in the supermarket. Next, take, take the cashier, pack the product, then pay the product after receive the products, and finally put, put the products in the carts and leave the supermarket. Okay, thank you very much for your presentation. Okay, very good presentation. Uh, so, so thank you, group. Just maybe... Um, for this last procedure, okay, for the purchasing procedure in the supermarket. Uh, maybe um, when you are talking about a procedure, uh, you need to use verbs, okay? Cuando estamos hablando acerca de un procedimiento, normalmente usamos verbos al principio. We use verbs at the beginning, okay? So, uh, because in this here is entrance, entrada. Okay, but, but I, I feel we need to use a verb, okay? Enter the supermarket or the parking, I don't know. Uh, park your car on the correct place. Sería park. Okay, parquea tu carro. Then take, this is okay, take the product in the supermarket. Uh, put the product in the car and leave the supermarket. Uh -huh. So in number one and number two, maybe we need to use some, some verbs, okay? And this is for everybody. When we are talking about procedures, we use verbs. Usamos verbos. We use verbs, okay? So thank you very much, Angela, Michelle, and Jansi. All right, thank you for your uh, presentation. In Margarita, then. In Margarita, too, all right. Thank you very much. Okay, so please, everyone, go to reaction and let's give them a wow. All right, let's give them a wow. Okay, thank you for your presentation again. And we listen to the last group. I don't know if they are ready because they had some problems. So, uh, Susana, Flor, Ingrid, and Carla, are you ready? <clears throat> ready to share. You're ready. Okay. Who is going to share screens? ¿Quién va a compartir la pantalla? Who is going to share the screen? Me. Me. 
Ok, Flor. go ahead. Adelante, Flor, go ahead. Okay, good evening. 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 Sorry? Maybe. Okay, adelante, go ahead. Todos, uh -huh. Next, uh, proceed for ma ma manufacturing products. Make a man manufacturing contracts and second register the contract DM DMM. Uh, Send the request the planning, the planning, presentation. Me la paso rápido. Product, um, no me deja leer. Mac <laughs> manufacturing contract. First presentation, teacher. Register the contract, the NM. Send the records, the planning. Manufacturing the products. Products analysis. Invoice and deliver the products. Okay, thank you very much. Next. Gloria, va a presentarlo, Gloria. Ah, yeah, it's okay. And the issue for receiving raw materials. Raw materials are received in the reception warehouse. It's number one. It's number two. Purchase and quality control are informed. Number three, the asset is entered into the system. Number four, Quality control analyze sample for seven days. And number six, number five, at the end of the quality, the matter is received into the system. Finally. <laughs> huh? And finally. Thank, thank you. And finally, it is already. Uh, finally. Ah, eh, permítanme. <laughs> es que no, lo... no le aparece a usted en la pantalla, quizá. Aparece lo último. Ah, okay. Flor, can you read it, please? El, and finally. El, el, okay. And finally, it is already available. For available. Manufacturing. Mm -hmm. available for manufacturing. Okay, thank you very much, group. Okay, thank you, uh, Susana, Flor, Ingrid, and Carla, that is not connected, right? Okay, thank you very much for your uh, presentation. Okay, we appreciate that. Thank you. All right, so um, good presentation. So everybody, go to reactions and let's give them a heart, please, okay? Please, everybody, go to reactions and let's give them a a heart okay thank you very much okay everyone so um well i want to say thank you very much for your presentations i know that it's not very easy like to talk in front of everybody 
It's not easy uh, to make a presentation, okay? And I know all of you are very busy. Yo sé que todos están muy ocupados. All of you are very busy working and you prepare the, the PowerPoint presentation, okay? So that's very appreciated. So believe me, thank you. Thank you very much for your work, okay? Okay, so uh, we are going, it's almost nine. So we are going to move uh, to a next activity. So uh, we are going to work on the material in this uh, moment. And for this, let me share a screen here. Uh, we are going to work um, on page number 19, okay? And on page number 19, we have two questions. This question will take a little long, okay? So question number one is, what steps, steps are like different, um, how can I tell you? Different parts, okay, different parts. Okay, what steps do you follow in your everyday work? In your work every day, what steps do you follow? You can say, for example, um, I get to work at 8 a.m. I turn on the computer, enciendo la compu, I turn on the computer, or I, um, I log in or I open my email, I don't know, all right? I visit uh, some employees or I check the machinery, I don't know, okay? These are the procedures you follow in your company every day, all right? At least, at least you need to mention five steps, at least five steps, okay? <clears throat> Next. What happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? This is in general. Esta es en general. This is in general, okay? ¿Qué pasa cuando un empleado no sigue los procesos? What happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures, okay? So let's take a moment for question number one. You can write at least five steps, okay? And in question number two is a general answer. Any question? This is on page number 19. Eso está en la página número 19. This is on page number 19. Any question? No? No, no question. Okay, page number 19. So I will give you seven minutes for this, okay? Siete minutos para esto, seven minutes for this. Is that okay? Enough time, suficiente tiempo, enough time? Yes? Okay. It's okay. In case you need more time, you tell me later, after the seven minutes, okay?
Okay, you have seven minutes and 20 seconds. Uh, do you need more time to complete or you are ready? Angela, Angela I'm ready. More time. Okay. So show me, please. If you are ready, let's follow the same uh, dynamic. Okay. Go to reactions and raise your hand if you are ready. Si están listos, vayan a reacciones y levantan la mano para ver quiénes, cuántos están listos, how many of you are ready. Okay. Okay. Miguel, Michelle, Joanna, Rosa, Mayra are ready. Only five. Okay. So I'll give you two more minutes. Dos minutos más. Two more minutes. Okay. Two more minutes, no more. In the meantime, I think I can pass the attendance. Mientras tanto, les pasaré asistencia entonces para aprovechar el tiempo to take advantage of, of time, okay? Ada? Here, teacher. Adriana? Present. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present, teacher. Very good. Darwin? Present teacher. Flor. Present. Okay, thank you. Gloria. Here. All right. Joanna. Present teacher. Very good. Lourdes. Present. Okay. Lourdes, eh, ¿tú tienes ahora la sesión uno a uno? Lourdes. Yes, teacher. Ah, okay. Yes. Okay, attend. Margarita? I'm here. Okay, Margarita. Long time no see. Long time no see, Margarita. Día de no verte. Yes, <laughs> I know. The most but, important. Yeah, but? Uh, I, I was. Yeah. Eating. Escuchando. You were uh, listening. Uh, listening. Uh, you were I listening heard. to the class. Yeah. Okay. It's yes. fine. It's fine. So welcome. Bienvenida. Okay. Uh, let's see Mayra. Present. En la clausura yo voy a decir. Miguel. Present. Nelson. Present teacher. Ophelia. Here teacher. Okay. Osmin. Present teacher. <clears throat> Rafael. Present. Very good. Rosa. Present. Nice. Sandra. Sandra. Sandra, hello. Present. Okay. Present. Present. Okay, Jancy. Present. Zulma. Here. Azalia. Present. Okay, and let's see Ingrid. Present teacher. And Susana. Present. Okay, that's very good. Thank you very much. Okay, so um, I said two minutes, right? Let me check the time. I gave you three minutes, all right? So um, I hope everybody is ready. And if you don't have the answers for the two questions, no problem, okay? So just share the answers you have. Solo respondan lo que tienen. Share what you have, okay? No problem, it's okay. So uh, for this, we have the two questions, okay? And let me give you the, the pronunciation of the questions again. Okay, let me share. Okay, so uh, the pronunciation of the questions is the following, okay? Question number one is, what steps do you follow in your everyday work? Again, what steps do you follow in your everyday work? Number two, what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? Follow. What happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? Okay. So the questions are on page number 19. Okay. Uh, for this activity, we are going to practice in groups. Okay. So please take turns practicing. Okay. So maybe Miguel can answer first and then Adriana and then Ada, okay? So when somebody else asks the question, y alguien más que le haga las preguntas, somebody else can ask the, the questions, okay? So I will give you about five minutes, four or five minutes to practice these questions in groups, okay? In groups. So let's go to practice then in groups. 
Okay, let me make the groups here. Okay, let's go to practice. Okay. Okay. Yo pregunto o me quieren preguntar a mí. Yo le pregunto. Okay. Listo. Okay. Uh, what steps do you follow in your everyday work? First, I get to the office and turn on my PC. Second, I have my breakfast and my I drink my coffee cup my cup of coffee. Okay. Third, I check my calendar. Later, I read and reply my emails. And finally, I attend my meetings. Okay. And what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? When an employee doesn't not follow the procedures, he receives a warning. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank okay. you, Mayra. I will ask to Ada. Yes. Ada, okay. what steps do you follow in your everyday work? Okay, first I get to the company. I give him to the document with which I work day before. Then I will file them and finally he give me the new document with which I am going to work during for the day. Okay. And the second question is what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? In my case in the department answers and search on the computer for a uh, force and prepare the phone for the day uh, and start my work. Okay. And what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? Um, I'm in, in my company, I'm prone to, to make a mistake or have, having an accident, a warning, I don't know, warning, okay. A warning, okay. it's okay, a warning. Warning, I warning, I warning. Okay. Now you ask to another person. Yeah. Yeah, oh, Flor. For HAM, I put my fingerprints, uh, I drink a coffee, and turn on the computer. I start my work, uh, I order my documents. I check my email and type the, the daily records. Okay, thanks. Next question is, what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? In my case, my work, accounting backlog, and payment of Finance. Okay, thanks. And Sulma. Finish. Only Sulma. Sulma. Hola. Ya se puede. Finish. Eh. Yes. Sí. Sí, sí, sí. 
Okay. okay. Question one. Uh, what one. extent do you follow work in your everyday work? So, um, I start work at 8.30 uh -huh. a.m. And first I... Um, number two. Got it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I am the question. What? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you are Sanya. Okay. What step? Uh, no. Uh, what step do you follow in your everyday work? Okay. Is it number one? Number one. <laughs> yes. I check email, WhatsApp, and rep and respond. Then I go organize the next days, wrote, make calls, enter file, stamp and print receipt. I enter the set lemons system and prepare a report for sending to accounting. Okay. Uh, what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedure? Uh, in my uh, immediate steps are taken to correct the, the Filer or non compliance. 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 No sé si se dice. Cumplimiento. Ajá. Compliance. Okay. Hay okay. okay. que cumplirlo. Compliance. Ajá. Compliance. But you are using. You want to say cumplir o cumplimiento? El cumplimiento. Ah, compl <laughs> you say compliance. Yeah, no, I ask, I ask because we have the verb. También tenemos el verbo. We have the verb that is comply. Comply with some processes, okay? Comply with. Ajá, cumplir con. Comply with. Ajá, compliance in this case. Compliance. 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 Cumplimiento. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, ¿A quién le pregunta? Continue. Continue. Pero no sabe por qué no le deja ver, castiguémoslo. Es que I, I'm, I'm staying uh, with my cell phone. Ah, ok. And I Pero read sí. the... And you respond. Ok. Number really, one. Really, really, in my case, in my... In my where I don't have steps. Maybe the first I check, I, I have to, oh, sorry. I check uh, the emails. Mm -hmm. um, Say, cinco, cuatro, the second, <laughs> Okay, everybody, thank you very much for taking the time to practice. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, now um, uh, we will listen to three people uh, answering the questions, okay? So let me see. Arsalia, can you tell me one name, please? Tell me one name, please. Any name. Boss teacher. Who? No, no le entendí, teacher. Can you tell me a name, please? A name of your of one of your classmates, okay? A name, a name of one of your classmates. Any name, cualquier nombre, any name you want. La que sabe más. Ah, mentira. <laughs> no, um... Lourdes. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, Lourdes. Uh... Lourdes. Thank you, Sally. Okay. <laughs> Question number one for you. What steps do you follow in your everyday work? Um, 
first I enter at 8 a.m. Yeah. Second, I connect to the system. Okay. Third, I check my email and answer each one. Um, then I talk to my co-workers with who need verified sales routes. Um, next, I have, um, I have lunch. Uh, after that, I return to my activities in my job. And finally, I go out at 5.30 p.m. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Questions for everybody. Questions for everybody. Does Lourdes have lunch? Does Lourdes have lunch? No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to see if you're paying attention, all right? Quiero ver si yes. están poniendo atención. Si están yes, prestando I'm atención. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. Lourdes, has, Lourdes has lunch. Has some lunch. Okay. Don't forget the lunch. Okay. <laughs> What time does Lourdes finish work? Here. At three. At three. At three. At three. Are you five. five. At five what? Five At five. Uh, five p.m. Five p.m. Lourdes, what time do you finish working? Five thirty p.m. At five thirty p.m. Right. Five thirty p.m. Five, PM. five thirty p.m. <laughs> Thank you. Le voy a hacer preguntas del siguiente. So pay attention, please. All right, pay attention. All right, let's see. Lower this. Uh, second question, lower this. What happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? Uh, the manager of a specific area talk with the employee. And if he is serious, the manager extend a warning. Oh, the manager gives a warning, all right? Mm -hmm. And if the problem continues... Mm, the employee is, I, I don't know, despedido. How do you say despedido in English, everybody? Fire. 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 Fire, fire. fire like fire. Fire, fire. fire. with you. Pensé que iba a decir bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> it's more easy. Next, yeah. So, so you can say uh, the manager says goodbye to the employee. <laughs> <laughs> All right. No, no, it's okay. You can say fire, okay? The employee is fire. The employee is fire. Fire, okay? Thank you very much, Lourdes. Uh, so we give the, the likes at the end, all right? So let's go to uh, another person, okay? Let's see. Darwin, can you tell me a name, please? Can you tell me a name of one of, you, of, of, one of your classmates? Uh, Michelle. Michelle, all right. <laughs> Michelle, all right, let's listen, pay attention because everybody pay attention because I will ask you some questions about Michelle, all right? So pay attention. Okay, Michelle, uh, what steps do you follow in your everyday work? Okay, in my case, first, I get to my work. Second, I clean my desk and my chair. Third, I turn on my computer. Fourth, I check my email. And finally, I start to do my task that I have scheduled. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, everybody. Uh, does Michelle clean the computer? Yes, she does. <laughs> no, 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 I can, now I can see you're paying attention. Okay, thank you. Now, Michelle, second second question. Ahora sí estaban poniendo atención. Now you were paying attention. Okay, Michelle, what happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? Well, in my company, if it's a minor fault, the employee only receive a warning. Okay. But if it's a major fault, uh, the employee receives an... Uh, a pay, un accidente personal. Sorry? I don't know how. Receives Accidente personal? How do you say? Una acción personal. Accidente personal. 
uh, no, maybe it's, in the personal... it's like a note, right? I think. Okay. It's a note. Then, uh... It's como una nota. Okay. No, no I, I am asking you. Oh, it's like okay. a note. Ah, yes, yes, yes. It's it's a note. Okay, like let... a note. Okay, I don't know that one, but I will check in a moment. Okay, thank you very much, Michelle. It's a memo to expedient. Is a is a memorandum? Exactly, uh, a, a memo. Expedient. Sorry? At, yes. At the expedient. Okay, is a memorandum for the expedient. Expedient yes. of the employee. Yes. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. Thank you very much. I I have heard memorandums, right? Like when, when they don't do something like correctly, they they design a memorandum for the employee. Okay, so that, yeah. that works. And they file it in the in the in the employee's expedient. Okay, as as Miguel is saying. That's what I heard. Okay. Yes. Non conformity. Sorry? Non conformity. Ah, that's the name of that. Ese es el nombre de la de, del, de, de la acción. Sí, una no conformidad. Ah, okay. So so you, how do you say it, oh, uh, Asalia? Can you repeat it? That's new for me. Non-conformity. Non-conformity. Okay. Thank you very much, Asalia. Okay. That's new for me. Thank you. I learned something today. Very good. Okay. Uh, thank you very much, Ana Michelle. And let's listen to our last participation. Okay. <clears throat> so let's see. Mayra, can you select someone, please? A boy, by preference. A boy. Um, Darwin. <laughs> Darwin selects and Darwin is selected. Esas son las hermanas. Venganza. La venganza. Okay. Well, well, well. Okay, let's listen to Darwin. Okay, Dar so pay attention to Darwin because I will ask you some questions about Darwin's information, okay, about Darwin's procedure in his company, okay? So Darwin, question number one, what steps do you follow in your everyday work? Okay, in my case, first, I get out before 8 a.m. Okay. Second, second at 8 15 I take a shower and breakfast at 8.35. Here at 9 p.m. I connect to my job and review report, send email, and analyze report at 12 o'clock for my lunch. Then in the afternoon, I have a meeting. Finally, I finish my work at 30 p.m. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, Darwin. Okay, questions for everybody. Does Darwin have meetings in the morning? Does Darwin no, have no. meetings in the morning? No. No, no he doesn't. No. Okay, when? When does he have meetings? The ah, in the afternoon. afternoon. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. Oh my goodness, you're paying attention. Very good. That's excellent. I like it. Um, <laughs> second question. Does us mean have breakfast? Swing, no. Swing, no. Ah. <laughs> now you're paying attention, right? I thought you were not paying attention. Okay, does Darwin have breakfast? Yes. 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 All right. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. No, I made a mistake. Okay. I wanted to say Darwin and I said Osmin. Okay. Okay. Very good. Uh, thank you very much. Now you're paying attention. Okay. Let's see. Next question for you, Darwin. What happens when an employee doesn't follow procedures? Okay, when an employee does not follow safety procedure, he can be suspended from his job. Um, if he reports, he can be fired. Okay, and he continues, he can be fired. Okay, thank you very much, Darwin. Okay, everybody, now please go to reaction and reactions and let's give participations a heart, please. Okay, so Darwin and the other participations, okay, let's give them a heart. Thank you for your participation. Okay, let's go to the next activity, okay? In the next activity, uh, we que have... Si lo yes. <laughs> okay, so in the next, we have a conversation, okay? The com this conversation is very different from the other conversations, okay? 
So it's about a process, about how to process a payment. Some people in the groups, they talk about how to process a payment, right? A payment procedure. So please listen to the pronunciation. I will pronounce the conversation two times. So listen, please, and pay attention to the pronunciation, okay? Okay, we start with uh, Javier. Sir, I forgot, I forgot how to process a payment. Process, process, not process, it's process. Como verbo se pronuncia process. Y como sustantivo se dice process, un proceso a process. But here, como verbo, process, process, okay? Yeah, okay, let's, let's start again. Sir, I forgot how to process a payment. All right. First, you give the options to pay in cash or credit card. After that, take the payment and put it in the register or US Lite card through the card reader. Then the register prints the receipt and you give it back to the customer. Finally, the customer signs the receipt and you keep a copy. Thank you, Mr. Moore. Listen again, please. Sir, I forgot how to process a payment. All right. First, you give the options to pay in cash or credit card. After that, take the payment and put it in the register or you slide the card through the card reader. Then the register prints the receipt and you give it back to the customer. Finally, the customer signs the receipt and you keep a copy. Thank you, Mr. Moore. Okay, so just for this word, okay? You say receipt, receipt, receipt. 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 La letra P no se, no se pronuncia. All this, toda esta parte que le voy a resaltar aquí, all this part, suena como una I larga. Receipt, receipt, okay? Receipt, receipt, and you give it back to the customer. The same here, receipt, okay, receipt. Good. Um, and don't forget this, this is process. Process a payment. No se dice process a payment, it's process a payment, okay? Process a payment. Okay, through, through the card reader, through, through the card reader, okay? Register, the, the register prints the blah, 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 okay? Keep a copy, all right? Keep a copy, and that's it. Okay, so this conversation is on page 19 again. So let's listen to some uh, participations here. First, let's listen to, um, to Susana and, and Miguel, okay? Miguel is, um, Miguel is, the manager, manager Moore, and Susana is Javier. So Susana, can you do it with Miguel, please? Okay. Hi, Miguel. Hi, hi Susana. Sir, I forgot how to process a payment. Process a payment. All right. First, you give the option to the pay in the cash or credit card. After that, take the payment and put it in the register on your slide card through the card reader. Then the register point the receipt and you give up and you give it back to the customer. Finally, the customer signs to receipt and you keep a copy. Thank you, Mr. Moore. Okay, thank you. That's very good. That's excellent. So now let's listen to Angela and Rosa. Angela, you are Javier, and Rosa, you are manager Moore. Okay. Okay, sir. I forgot how to process a payment. All right. First, you give the options to pay in cash or credit card. After that, pay the payment and put it the register on your slide, the card to the card reader. Then the register prints the receipt and you give it back to the customer. Finally, the customer signs the receipt and you keep a copy. Thank you, Mr. Moore. Okay, thank you very much. That's excellent. Let's listen to Rafael and Margarita. Rafael, you are um, Javier and Margarita, you are manager Moore, okay? Hello, 
Rafael es. Rafael is Javier and Margarita, you are manager Moore. Okay. Sir, I forgot how to process a payment. All right. First, you give the options to pay in cash or credit card. After that, take the payment and put it put it in the register or to slide the card through the card reader. Then the register prints the receipt and you give, give it back to the customer. Finally, the customer signs the receipt and you keep a copy. Thank you, Mr. Moore. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, um, now, okay, thank you for your uh, participation to so pronounce the conversation. And now, here we have two questions, right? Question number one, these questions are about the conversation. Pay attention to the questions. Question number one is, what steps does manager Moore give Javier to process a payment? What is step number one, according to manager Moore? What is step number one, according to manager Moore? Give the options to pay in cash or credit card. Good, that's excellent. What is step number two? Anybody? Uh, take the payment on the board, uh, but at the register, take your display and car sums to car reader. Good. What is the step number three? Thank you very much. The then the register is... prints the receipt and you, you give it back to the customer. Okay. Thank you. And the last one, what is the last step? Finally, the, the customer sends the receipt and you, you keep the car copy. Okay, thank you. Two people at a time. I like it. Very good. Okay, so finally, the customer signs the receipt and you keep a copy. Question number two. What words does manager Moore use to order the sequence of steps? Okay, uh, manager Moore uses some vocabulary to organize the sequence of events or the sequence of, of steps, okay? What is the first word he uses? First. First, first, first is word number one. What is the second word? After, after that. After that. After that. After that. And what is after that in Spanish? Right. And what is the next word a manager Moore uses? Then. 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 And the last word? Finally. 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 So he closes using finally. Okay. Finally, we have 20 minutes. Last activity for today. Ultima actividad para hoy. Last activity for today. So listen. Here, okay, we have um, some, some cases of some difficult customers, okay? So, and we have the question. Do you ever meet difficult customers? Okay. Do you ever meet difficult customers? Uh, ¿Alguna vez conoces o con frecuencia conoces a clientes que son difíciles, okay? Many. Difficult, many, 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 many customers, okay? So it's your time. So here we have one, two, three, four, five difficult customers. So, and we have five situations for difficult customers, okay? So the idea is that you select, okay, one of these situations, okay? We have five situations, okay? You will select one situation and you are going to list and describe five steps that you could use to deal with the difficult with the difficult customer. Okay, how can you handle this difficult customer? So you need to think of five steps, cinco pasos para lidiar con ese cliente, five steps to deal with this customer. Okay, yeah. So you Number first. Five. Okay, it's your decision. This is personal. Okay, you can select one, two, three, four, or five. Is your decision. But for this, you are going to work in pairs. For this, you are going to work in pairs. Mm -hmm. So step, let me explain the, the, the procedure for this activity, okay? Let me explain the procedure for this activity. First, okay, first, select one situation. After that, uh, you describe or you write some steps, okay, to solve the problem for this situation, okay? 
And finally, you come here and you present to your classmates, okay? Finalmente venimos y presentamos a sus compañeros. You present to your classmates. Any question? This is on page uh, number uh, 19. Página 19, page number 18. So you are going to work in pairs. Do you have any question before you work? No? No, teacher. No. Oh, my goodness. Quiero felicitarlos ahorita. Sí, me gusta ver las cámaras encendidas de todos. <laughs> no lo había notado. Ah, solo... Ah, ok. Solo faltaba Mayra y Yancy, pero ya estaban. <laughs> no, no lo había notado, Mayra. Mayra y Yancy no, no lo, no lo Para no notado. quedarse atrás, las encendieron. <laughs> no, Mayra y Yancy, no lo había notado. Okay? Solo había visto así, las la de arriba, todas las cámaras encendidas. And, and I say, oh my goodness, all right? Everybody has the cameras on. Okay, thank you. Okay, so for this activity, we are going to work in pairs, okay? And you have like 17 minutes, like, yeah, like 15 minutes to work on this, okay? So please take advantage of time. So let's go to work. Then, okay, va a haber un equipo de tres. We are going to have a group of three members, okay? So let's go to work. Page 19. igual ok este escogemos cuál le gusta cuál le gusta pues para mí sería por mí eh, number five la cinco quiero ver uh -huh. a group of customer are creating obsess because is too slow eso sí es que sí es una situación, situation eh, más común. Ok. Porque en algún lugar, porque siempre hay este como cajeros lentos, ¿verdad? Entonces, y yo, y uno apresurado. <risa> ya sea que vaya a un supermercado, un restaurado, lo que sea, pero como que a uno, como que le... Ah, por ejemplo, cuando uno va a um, um, una celebración, Ce Celebration Happy Day, uh -huh. Happy Birthday, 
y uno va corriendo. ¿no? Entonces, como que quiere que lo atiendan como que rápido y a la hora de pagar, que se apure el mesero a pagar la cuenta. Entonces, eh, no sé, por eso me llama la atención esa. No, ok. Uh -huh. vale, entonces, ¿qué hacemos con este tipo de situación, verdad? Uh -huh. Yes. Para okay. mí que podría ser este, que no hubiera solo un, un cajero. Podría Ajá. ser. Pero eran más, más uh, cajas para atención de clientes. Bueno, en este caso es un restaurante. Restaurante. Ah. Ah, entonces, Porque aquí dice que es un... Uh -huh. No, aquí dice... O no sé, no, no dice... Que, eh, no. Un grupo de gente se enoja porque un cajero es demasiado lento. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces, no necesariamente es... es Ay, un, aparte, de, en una de esas podría poner este, una sugerencia. La sugerencia, ¿verdad? El buzón de sugerencias. Que en algunas empresas no los toman en cuenta. No. Entonces. Sí, se hace del intento. Ajá. Por ejemplo, que, que capaciten. Capacitar más al personal. Voy a ponerlo aquí. Que sean dos cajeros. Dos o más. Rapidez en la atención. Pro de collection system. Improve. Ajá, mejorar el sistema de cobro. Improve the collection system. Ok, improve. Improve de qué? De collection. Colección, collection, ah, collection. System, el sistema de cobro. Ah, ok. I think that system payment. Okay. Number three, when, Number when three. you prepare more to, to employ, uh, cuando usted capacita más, capacite employee. Capacitar, okay. capaciti. Train. Training. Yes, training. No, it's train. 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 Okay, train. Train. No train. Train. Ah, train. Train, uh, train. train better your employees. And then, uh, train. Train better the employees. Train, train the employees train more. better. You say. No, sir. Train Only, employee better. Uh -huh. Or you can say train the employees a little more. Un poquito más. A little more. Oh. Mm -hmm. Train employees a little more. A little more, yeah. A little more. A little... Okay, number four. Number four. Wow. What? Que no vayan a esa tienda. Oh, really? No vayan. This almost in this... Um... I will be more cashier. Improve the collection system. We three, we three Train. solutions. What? We have ah. three. Ah, sí. Two, you're missing two. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. Okay, 45. No. Four. 
Okay, a little more. Maybe, maybe promotion at Sí, ahorita ya estuvo. Ahorita la meto. Teacher, how do you say intervenir? You can say intervene. 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 Ah, uh, intervene. Yeah. Intervene. Ya la buscaron. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yeah. Sí, pero me, me lo ponía como step in. Step in. Okay, let me let me see. Let, let me, just let me confirm my my, my word. Take part, okay. tomar parte en algo, ha huh? intervenir, ha huh? intervene. It's okay. You can say intervene. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So you finished? Yes, teacher. All right. Yes. <laughs> okay, that's Bye. excellent. <laughs> Solicitar autorización. Solicitar, autoriz solicitar autorización de cambio de producto. Que sería request, request product change. Autoriz autorization, creo que es request. Then, then request. Request de auto autorization to change no. product. Es correct, teacher. Solicitar autorización para cambiar productos. Request say, product. Hmm? Say it in English, please. I want to listen. Say it in English. Request, request product autorization to the change product. What do you want to say? You, you said, sorry. Solicitar autorización para cambiar productos. Yeah, it's okay. In English. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, I have to request okay. authorization to change products. Mm -hmm. It's okay. 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 Ya teniendo la autorización, sería auto auto. Then 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 then. Do the change. Next. Next es el otro. Y, eh, Cinco pasos dijo. Uno, mm. dos. Next. Eh, contactar Recon al cliente. Contactar al cliente que se le va a enviar el, el nuevo producto. Y podríamos como recompensarlo con algo para bajarle Ajá, entonces cuatro sería contactar al cliente que se le va a enviar se le va, se le va a enviar el nuevo producto y cinco Ajá. decirle que se le va a mandar un algo para que se quede Pero para se quede satisfecho para cubrir el, el error de la orden. Sí, sí pero puede ser? ser un presente o un que un no, uno postre o algo, o una, algo de, siempre como estamos hablando de comida. Bye. Eh, ¿Qué más? Propose a favor solution for the customer. El cuatro, el cinco, no, no, fue este ahí un poco. Solo nos, solo nos falta uno, pinche. All right. Pero no sé. <risa> agradecer. agradecer por la... <risa> no se me ¿Sí? no, pero está bien. Agradecer por, por, por your pasión, por, por su paciencia. What step do you have? Uh, what, what, what A customer is on, on, hungry or angry because his food was not delivered on time. Ah, okay, I see. First, listen a customer. Okay. Uh, second, tell to the customer with the right tone of you. Okay. Tono de okay. Uh, third, apologize for what happened. Okay. 
Uh, mm. Next, propose a favorable, favorable, ¿cómo se dice? Uh, favorable. Fa favorable solution for the customer. Okay. And finally, I don't know. <laughs> Giving something, offer a dessert or as an apology. Ah, offers. No, I don't know. A, a dessert or a un, drink. Un postre de cortesía. Okay, ah, uh, yeah. Okay, offer a drink or a dessert as an apology. Como una disculpa, as an apology. Offer, offer a dessert a drink. or dessert. Uh -huh. A drink or dessert as an apology, como una disculpa, as an apology. As, um, apology. Apology. Uh -huh. Okay. Like this, let's see. As an apology, as as como, como una disculpa, as an apology. Apology. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Apology is disculpa, right? Creo que han visto esa palabra. Sí. Uh -huh. As an sí. apology, okay. Come on. Mm -hmm. Hey, we finish. Okay, very good. Okay, yeah. okay. Bye, so thank you. Bye. I know. Customer. Well, for the moment, I'm going to wait. Sí, que el teacher. ¿Qué les aparece el tiempo? No. Le puse close all rooms, pero no me aparece nada ahorita. Creo que está trabado eso. Quedó frisado. Sí, quizás seguramente sea.